Hello, this is MPG Jer 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 here with my Boston Airport military base slash Brotherhood Embassy build. This is an Xbox One survival mode build. So as you can see, this is the entrance to my base. It's a very small but well thought out base, I believe. Uh, as you can see, I have fully functioning APCs, Jeeps, and artillery cannons. Up here on the right, this is our armory where our Master of Arms is usually stationed, but she must be off getting drunk or something because she's not at her post. That's slacker. So next, I'm going to show you my artillery cannons that are not meant to be menace to a, the Brotherhood airship, but also strike fear into them that if they decide to attack the Commonwealth, it won't end pretty for the Pridwin. Over here is my APC repair station and a couple beds for the mechanics or just soldiers that can't fit in the main barracks. Now up here is a little watchtower I built. It's manned by Private Buck. He's checking out the landscapes, making sure everything's good. And it's also guarded by a couple turrets. So exiting, we're going to go into the main structure of the base. This is where the muster hall slash cafeteria is, which is right here. We have Private Rufus, our own personal cook. We have soda machines, all the amenities that a soldier could want in my military. So next we'll go to the barracks or the bunks where my soldiers sleep, rest after a hard day's work or missions, etc. And they're very cozy for our soldiers, although tight, but it's better than nothing. Next we're going to go up to the control room, or briefing room. This is where the sergeant of the base is live. So this sergeant is the first ghoul to make rank that high in my military. Yes. He took over for the last sergeant who was killed in a raider skirmish, unfortunately. But we are very proud of his efforts and dedication. So this is where we send out patrols, where I m meet up with the captain, sergeants, etc., and send them out on missions, or we just do briefings, debriefings, etc. So next we're going to show you to a recently built structure that goes out the back of the base and leads directly to the Brotherhood's main base of operations inside the airport. This is a very new operation, and it connects both my base and their base together and gives free access either or. There's my wall. Now, well, here comes an unfortunate sight. So this is this is Cherie Rice. She was the sergeant of this base, killed by uh by the freaking raiders, and unfortunately we haven't buried her yet. Yep, yeah, there's some flags symbolizing that this is the embassy slash base here. And uh this is the structure I was talking about, even with some light. And uh yeah, this will be the way that the Brotherhood can enter my base or we can enter their area. It's a very efficient design. Uh, we have our statue there, symbolizing that this is the Minutemen's area right here. While the Brotherhood do have a f huge presence here at the airport, we still have ours too. And this has been my Brotherhood Embassy slash Minutemen military base here at the Boston airport.